Hi guys, I'm here on location in the beautiful Bahamas. And for our daily workout today, we're gonna be using one of these bands. It's a loop band. Um, I've got a moderate to heavy resistance. They also make lighter ones as well. Uh, if you don't have a loop band, just grab a TheraBand or a Flex Band, about shoulder distance or a little wider apart, fold it over, tie a little knot until you have a band roughly Let's go like collarbone width wide. That'll probably be good enough for you. So pause the video if you need and then grab your band and let's get you guys moving. Put the band off to the side to begin with. I want you to take your feet about hip distance apart to start. Find a tall posture, full breath in, reach your arms up. And as you exhale, lower right back down. Do that twice more. Big breath in, reach your arms up. Exhale, lower down one more time. All right, guys, you've got a full total body workout coming up with a lot of it with the band. Take your hands onto your hips and start by hinging back, coming down into a squat and rise up. Sit back and rise. All right, let's go eight. Lift, sit back, seven and up. Now in six, we'll add those arms. Five, lift, four, three, keeping your abdominals engaged. Here's two. On your next one, you're down, and here we go. Reach down, lift up. Reach down, lift up. It's eight. Reach. Seven. Feel your heart rate rising. Feel your legs working. Final four. Up. Three. Lift. Two. Now let's stay down on your next one. Pause. Sweep your arms. Bounce at eight. Now feel that you've got springs into your legs. Nice little bouncy quality. Now I want you to step to your right side. Step and in. Same side. Step. Back in. Eight. Seven. Again, feel that bounce quality. Sit back and in. Five. Feel your abs in. Four. Three. Two. On your next one, hold to the center. Pause. Drop it down. Let's repeat. Sit back. Lift. Six more. Four up three squeeze those legs close two next time hold it down pulse it again for eight lift those arms up pull your ribs back five four three now let's move to your opposite side down together sit back and in eight seven and again sit it back six pull all the way in final four three two one, hold it in. Last time, you're down, lift. So I do teach a lot of bar classes in my studio. So kind of like a bar less class, but with our band involved. Here's three, two, hold it down, pause, lift your arms. Now heels up, heels up. So as you sit back a little bit so your weight is behind you more, lift to the heels or lift to the toes, sorry. You got four, three, two. Let's stay down, pause, rise it up, drop your heels, lift. Heels down, lift. It's eight, up, six, rise. All right, keep those abs in, guys. You got four more to go. Three more, two more. Stay down, lift your arms, Heels rise up, pulse it again, let's go down. Seven, six, five, four, three, drop your heels side to side. We're gonna step one way together, opposite, together. Right, left, all right, final six, in, five, in, four more to go, three more, two more, one, grab your band. All right, we're gonna start by taking that band around your ankles. Let's begin with your feet a little bit apart. Now I want you to take your feet and ever so slightly externally rotate them. So the insides of your feet are gonna be lined up to parallel. Stomach engaged. Remember those squats? Of course you do. Let's go. Down, reach, sit back and rise. All right guys, you got five more to go. Now in four, you're gonna go back to those pulses. Three, two, stay down, pulse it right here. Now have the sense of you're pushing out into the band with your feet. Four, three, travel to your right. Right, keep the tension. Right, keep the tension. Six, for those glutes. Four, three, two, 
hold it back to the center, back to the squat. Down, lift up this time, like our warm up. Eight, rise. We've got five more to go. In four, we'll stay down. Three, two, one. Stay down and pulse. Reach it again up into your arms. Last four, three. Now move it left side. Out, pardon. Out, try to keep that tension. I always think of landing on the ball of my foot first. All right, four, three, woo, two. Can we go side to side? One right. Now one left. Back to the right. Are you burning yet? Back to your left. All right, guys, six, five, four, three. I'm burning with you. Two. One, back together, rise all the way up from here. Now shift your way over to your right foot. Soften the knee, point your left toes. Now lift, lower, lift, lower. Six, tap, five, tap, four, pulling against the band. Three, feel your buns. Two, swap sides, other way, let's go. Shift, lift the leg. Eight, seven. Up and release, up and release. You've got four more to go, guys. Three more to go, please. Two, alternate side to side. We go, star, lift, over, lift, over. All right, if you want, you can even add your arms. We'll call this our falling star. Final five, up, four, up, three, two, one, now pause, turn to your side. Now I'm gonna keep the band around my ankle and then just slip it around the back of my foot. Now into a lunge position here. Drop again into the back knee, lowering the legs, lift. Keeping a subtle bend to the front leg, pressing off with your back ball of your foot, keep it going. Six, up, five, up, four more please, lift, three more, lift, Two, last time, pause it down, pulse your thighs. Now, how tall could you keep your torso? Could you reach your arms all the way up and overhead? Let your fingertips touch. Six, four, three, two, and one. Now from there, reach the arms forward, straighten the back leg. Keep it soft though, so it's not locked. Add a little woodpecker from our foundation work, hinge, and pull yourself, come right back up. You've got 10 foundation trainings, integrated woodpecker hinges. Hinge back into the hips and lift the torso. Hinge back, lift up. It's eight, reach, seven, up, six. Keep that front foot firm, five, pull, four, lift, hinge. Two, now stay down, pause. Option one, take your measure sticks from our foundation training, thumb to the ribs, pinky to the pelvis. Let's rotate that back hip in towards the inner thigh, come back again to the center. Rotate the hip, come back to the center now a little quicker. Eight, up, seven, really spinning around that left glute as much as we can. Five, head high and proud, you got four more. Three, pull the ribs in. Two, last time, one, back to the center, rise up, turn to the side, and let's go again. Opposite direction this time. So slide the band around your ankle, and then take the band around your foot of the leg that's gonna go behind you. Let's go back to those lunges. Torso tall, abdominals engaged, start with the drop. Down, lift. Inhale down, exhale rise. We've got eight, up, seven, up, six. Now make sure that the ball of your back foot is firmly planted. Four, three, into the lunge. Two, now stay down and pulse. All right, now find the length into your hip flexors. Feel your torso a little taller. Reach your arms right here, guys. Eight, seven, six, stay tall. Five, four, three, two, and one. Arms forward, back leg straightens a little bit more. Option to come to the measure sticks. Let's go back to the hinge. Back into the front hip, rise up to the top. Inhale as we hinge, exhale, now add your arms. Eight, 
pull. Seven, feel that front hamstring and glute very active. Pull back, lift up, hips hinge. Three, two, stay down, pause, back to the measure six. Take the right pointed part of your hip, that ASIS, the little bony knob of the pelvis, rotate it across to your inner thigh. Feel those glutes come back to the center. Chin back, chest lifted, let's do that again. Rotate it again and back to the center. Again, our foundation trainings, um, woodpecker rotation. Let's keep the pattern going as you rotate, center, rotate, center, six. Spin it around into that glute, guys. You've got four, three, two, last time, one. Back to the center, hinge your body up, rotate all the way through, and let's come down onto the ground. From here, I want you to come to a seated position, and let's take that band up higher by your knees. Now, as you lay all the way down, grab behind your thighs and roll down completely onto your back from here. Let your arms rest down beside you, plant your feet firm. Now, have your legs about hip distance apart. Stomach muscles engage, torso long and tall, plant your feet firm. Press into the feet as you lift the hips up. Hinge and lower the hips right back down. We've got 10. Up, lower. Nine, lower. Now keeping that tension into the band. Don't clench your glutes, but really press into your feet. Engaging all the muscles of your legs. Three, two, stay lifted, pause for one. From there, plant your left foot firm. Peel the right leg up, come to a tabletop position. Now, as you begin to lower the hips, tap your toes, lift the hips and pull the leg up. Lower the hips, tap your toes, lift up, now a little faster. Eight, up, seven, up, six, five. Ab strong, guys, you got four more, up, three more, up, two more. Lift last time, hold it up, stay, lower that foot down, plant your right foot firm, Heel the left leg, come to tabletop, lower the hips. We tap, lift, inhale, exhale, eight, up, seven, whoo, feel those glutes, hamstrings and abs for four, lift, three, lift, two, last time, hold it up, stay, lower your foot down, Lift your heels as you walk your feet a little closer. Let's go back to the hinges. Drop the hips. Ten. Up. Nine. Eight. Plant the feet firm. Seven. And six. We'll stay up again. Stomach in, guys. You got four more to go. Lift. Three. Up. Two. Stay lifted. Hold at the top. Drop your heels. Lower. Lift. Lower. Now try to get that great articulation of your ankles and feel the length of the thighs. Five more, four more, three, two, one. Lift the heels, lower them back down, articulate your spine as you roll through and draw your knees in towards your chest. Now take that band and I want you to slide it down by your feet. Then it's gonna go around the arch of your right foot and the ankle of your left foot. From there, take your hands, interlace your fingers behind your head, pull your hands and your elbows wide, nod your chin, lift the torso up. If possible, try to come to a neutral alignment of the pelvis, imprint only if you need. Now press the right leg out, keep the left leg still, bend the right knee, come back in. Stomp into that right foot, reach, bend the knee back in, now a little quicker, eight, Pull, seven, try to keep that left leg stable, press. All right, we've got four, in, press. And last two, on your next one, stay out, pause. From there, can you lift both legs up, lower both legs down with the tension in the band. Inhale to lift, exhale to lower. Six, release, five, Inhale up, exhale lower for three, two, and on your next one, lower down part of the way about 45 degrees. 
swap the legs. So now the band is going around the ankle of the right foot, arch of the left. Let's stomp that left leg out. Press, pull. Now pull the elbows wide. Even though the torso is lifted, you could fit your fist right between your chin and your chest. Five. Three. Two. Keep those abs in. Now pause out for one. Lift your legs up and down. Lift. Lower. Six. Five. Four. Three. Stay up there, guys. Two. I know I'm burning with you. One, drop the legs, now switch, alternate legs. Right leg presses out, left leg presses out. Eight, switch, seven, push, six, fill those abs, five. Four more to go, guys. You got this in three, two, and one. Both knees come back in, lift the torso a little higher, and lower all the way back down. Let's slide that band back up to the outsides of your thighs. Plant your feet again down firm, arms out by your side, broadening your shoulders, pressing more to the pinky finger. Find your foundation training's half sphere attention onto your ground. As your collarbone stays wide, your stomach muscles are engaged, we're gonna get into a little train work with our legs or with our feet. So begin by bridging, lifting the hips up. Then rise up onto the balls of the feet, lower your hips straight down, and then lower back into the heels. Hips up. Heels up, hips down, heels down. Let's go two more slow. Hips up, heels up, hips down, heels down. One more slow. Hips up, heels up, hips down, heels down. Now a little bit faster. Lift, heels, lower, release. Lift, heels, lower, release. We've got five, lift, Lower, four more, lift, heels. Keep those abdominals in, three, lift. Last two, bridge, lift. Last time, now stay at the top, lift the heels and pause. Walk your feet in a little bit closer, plant the left foot firm, peel the right leg up, but stay on the left ball of your foot. Here we go, guys, we're gonna repeat that bridge as you lower the hips, tap your toes, Bridge the hips up on the ball of the foot. Inhale, we lower. Exhale, rise. Eight, up, seven, up, lower, five. Fill those glutes in four, lift, three, lift, two. Last time, stay at the top. Lower the ball of your right foot down. Lift the left leg up and let's repeat. Hips down, hips up. Inhale. Exhale, six, five, up, four more to go, three more to go, two, and one. Lower your foot, lower your heels, articulate the spine, roll all the way down, and slide that band again back by your ankles. All right, interlace your fingers again. Take your hands behind your head, nod your chin. Flex the trunk forward, and let's take the right leg back out, having it again go around your ankle on your left foot, but around your right arch of your foot. Now, I want you to, from here, add a rotation, right shoulder towards the bent left knee, return back to the center. Do that again. Legs stay still, but your upper trunk's gonna rotate. Eight, center, seven, center. Reach out long into those legs. Press into that right heel. Four, three, two, and one. Back to the middle, swap your legs, stomp that left foot out firm, and let's rotate. Eight, obliques, seven, cross it. Your shoulder, not your elbow. Four, three, two, and last one, return to the center, bend both of your knees in, grab behind your thighs, roll yourself up, and let's take the band around the thighs again. And let's come onto your right side. All right, now prop yourself up on your right elbow. 
let your knees come together, and I want you to line your toes, your heels, and your sit bones up as you pull up into the bottom side of your torso. From there, it's like a clamshell exercise. Plant your toes firm. Externally rotate the top thigh, take the knees again back together. Let's do that again. Exhale, lift, inhale down. Clamshell up and release. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Now lower your knees and I want you to lift up into your hips. Hips up, hips down. Hips up, hips down. Six, now your top hand can come to the hip, can stay down, you can even lift it up towards the sky, either way. Three, two, now let's put two and two together. As you lift your hips up, can you open up like a clamshell? As you lower the hips, also lower your top knee. Let's repeat. Exhale to rise up, inhale to lower a little faster. Eight, seven, six, five, so the outer glutes and the opposite side obliques. Two, one, other side. Turn it around, keep the band around your thighs, and let's drop your elbow down. Pull up, engage those deep abdominal muscles, pull up out of your shoulders, toes, heel, sit bones line up. Let's go, knee up and down. Exhale, inhale, six, five, four, pull in against strong into the band, three, two, now let's keep the knees together, pull up to your outer side, we go up and down, exhale, inhale, six, five, up for four and down, up for three and lower, two, now let's add the top leg, here we go guys, eight, seven, four, keep those abs in, three, two, and one, come all the way down. Now turn onto your hands and your knees. Let's keep the band around your thighs, shoulders, elbows and wrists all lined up, spread your fingers firm, and let's take your thighs apart until you've got enough tension on the band that you can feel some work happening. Curl the toes under. Now I want you to lift the knees and your hips in a long, neutral posture spine, then lower right back down. Let's repeat. Exhale, rise. Inhale, lower. Exhale, up. I'll pick it up the tempo. Eight, seven, six. Feel those thighs. Feel your shoulders. Two, now stay lifted and pause. Now I want you to shift forward towards your hands and back into your heels. Forward towards your hands, back into your heels. A little quicker, guys. Forwards, press. Spring forwards, press. Five, four, three, two, one. Now keep your knees hovered. Put a lot of weight into the left hand and the left foot. Tap your right hand to your left knee, come back to the center other side. Left hand to the right, quick in that tempo. Right, left. Now try to keep the least amount of your upper body moving as possible right here. Six, five more each way. You guys are doing awesome. You're almost done with your daily workout for four. In, three, how low could you keep those knees hovered but not touching? Two, in, one more each way, hand, hand and release. Come down to the knees, walk the legs back, widen the hands, push-ups, let's go. Eight, press, seven, whew, six, spring it up. Abs in, guys, for four, three, two, and you are done. Excellent job today, guys. Sh uh, shift your weight back, find a good stretch like a little shell pose. Then inflate the ribs by breathing barely big, really big up into the diaphragm. Pull the hips back a little further, reach your arms out more in front. Walk your hands to the left. Stretch that right side body a little bit more. How far could you take that right hand away from your right hip? Go the other way. Walk your hands to the right. Reach that left arm out. 
How far could you pull that left hand away from your left hip? Come back to the center and you are done. Thank you for tuning in and for joining me on this beautiful day out here in Eleuthera, Bahamas. I hope you guys are staying safe and you're having a great rest of your day. See you again on the mat.